Good morning, guys. Today is Monday, seventeenth of May, and um, today is our first full day here in the UK. We are now back in the British soil. We are in Norway. I'm standing in our kitchen, so we have a new house. Um, so we arrived last night very late. I think it was like about ten o'clock in the evening, um, and so we slept at about but um, past midnight, and then wake up uh, early again. Let me help you. Okay, so there's a lot of things to do because we just arrived last night. We need to set up our sofa, bed, all the clothes, etc. But luckily, we've got some groceries already we've got some food but also when we were in norway um a couple of days ago uh, we've already bought um some grocery shopping um food shopping online um here in the uk to be delivered today so it will arrive um today between seven to nine in the morning and it is currently like nearly seven o'clock in the morning and it's raining outside. We've got a small little garden outside, very cute, and it's raining because we are in the UK. Our little garden, it is miserable. Yeah, that's like UK weather. And my guess is like if we are in Norway right now, it will be sunny, like cold and sunny. So yes, uh, there's still a lot of, just a sneak peek of everything that we've uh, <laughs> that we've taken with us uh, last night um, lots of things to do today so it will be a very busy day um, but I'll show you once the grocery arrived um, I don't know is it Asta I think it was Asta and um, then I'll show you what we've got because it will be a good comparison of how much you can actually get here in Norway because it's a bigger market so you can get lots of foods, different varieties, and very cheap in comparison to Norway, which is like small market, very expensive. So yeah, that would be a good comparison. I'll show you all the things that we've got later on as soon as uh, the groceries arrive today. It's a quick one. Um, so we've got some things from Waitrose uh, that arrived. So we've got Heinz, peas, penne pasta, jasmine rice. We've got uh, vegetable cooking oil. Um, we've got some treats for the kids, like cookies and shortbreads and things like that. And just the things I've unpacked coming from Norway. We've got courgettes. We've got some crisps that I think Will was eating last night because I can hear like something in the kitchen. <laughs> uh, we've got uh, skimmed milk. Um, some more treats here. Um, cocoa pops, which I've already put in this jar. We've got white bread. Um, Heinz, look at this, Peppa Pig, wow, what a merchandise, they're everywhere. So we've got a couple um, of those, we've got a tuna, oh that's a salmon, oh it's a salmon, okay. Um, peanut butter, we've got a couple of beer, we've got tissue paper over there, so we've got a couple of beer, we've got Ribena of course, because we're in the UK, um, and we've got a Prosecco guys for Margaret who doesn't want some Prosecco and a champagne and a couple of milk from yesterday's journey Peroni beer and what else have we got here just quickly so we've got Heinz beans uh, we've got a couple of those um, what else that I've missed I think that's it and then just some yeah we've got baby's milk and just some essentials like washing up liquids um, body wash and some bin bags, nappies. You can look like I said, um, some more groceries are coming today. Our groceries are here, and I'm right, it's from us the big crisps. Morning, <laughs> sorry. You stay up there, look. Look at this, guys. The whole kitchen floor is just full of food. So Will ordered like a month's worth of groceries. Yes, Ate. Oh, very excited to open this already. Can you open this, Daddy? But look at the... <laughs> from 
Oh, I can't even like uh, a total of this. All of this is about three hundred pounds, so that's like three thousand crown. So, like in no way, you can't get this much for that price. Possibly like this much. Yeah, just maybe just around that much for like the same price. So yeah, this is what I was uh, one about earlier. So yeah, we'll go through it and just see like what are the things that we've got. It's a bit crazy. Actually, I can just like start doing it like real quick for you. Cocoa Pops, like very popular cereal bars. Lurpap, that's a big one. Butter, baguettes, you've got black pudding, oh, yes. mushroom, garlic bread. Have you got sausage? Mm, yes, yes. Oh, yes. did you? Broccoli. Um, oh yeah, here it is. Cumberland sausages. Which is, uh, we're very excited about, digestives, um, rich tea, what is this one, Johnson's honey soup, toothpaste, cucumber, it's just a mismatch, mismatch of everything, pate, um, tresemme, now this one is very cheap here, this is 500 ml and you can only get this for like, maybe if it's on sale, two pounds, like if it's regular regular like about four pounds pate pork pies um cheese sticks now this one is very crazy oh was it oh no this one is fine about baby bells because i saw one at many in norway and it was it cost four pounds for baby bells and baby bells here is like a pound um so yeah here it is oh it's uh, a bit of a yeah it's like a month's worth because uh, we are home quarantining, so uh, we are not allowed to leave the house for five days. But today, the 17th of May, I think there will be new rules here in the UK. So let's see. Um, as far as we know, it's like 10 days that we're not supposed to leave. And then uh, with these new rules, I think hopefully it will be just five days. So yeah, let's carry on. So we've got a big bag of um, loo roll. Um, look at this. Uh, giant cow's milk so this one uh, blue cap it's the same and um, I think in Norway you will get like red ones that are like 4% uh, milk now this one is full fat but these are like massive these are like 3,408 mil so we've got two of those they're very cheap here cow's milk um, so we've got potatoes there nappies coffee coffee mates uh, this one is a um, a cider 10 pack um, also cheap here um, unlike in uh, Norway and we will have to go to the border Swedish border just to get like cheap meat and alcohol and um, just to get like a cheap groceries but because of COVID we are not able to do that because the borders are closed um, so yes we've got stuck with like really expensive food in Norway. Let's carry on. Aside from the cocoa pops, we've got rice crisps as well, Kellogg's. Two of those big bags that are super huge. Um, and we've got custard cream, that's biscuits, Nicola likes biscuits. Um, what are these? We've got Oreos. You have to ask Daddy Nuck if you want to open this. So we'll like bought lots of toys for them. Papa Pig Bowl, more crisps. We've got PG Tips, very, very British. Uh, yeah, tea. We've got pear, capsicum, that's bell pepper, um, lettuce. What are these? Vinegar. We've got a couple of bowls while we are waiting for our stuff to arrive from Norway. And this is what Will is most excited about. And they're very cheap here. Stilton cheese. Just cheeses in general here are just cheap. Um, Carrots down there. That's his white bread. Chicken. Um, like a big box, 12 packs of baby wipes. Angel, like this, this is for kids. So this one, you actually need to mix them. So you've got different flavors. So we've got banana and we've got, I saw some as well. I don't know where I've put it. Um, but yeah, this is like um, just cream for kids in general. Oh, and on this bag, we've got a couple of, like, fish finger foods and, like, breaded foods. We've got pork belly. I'm so excited to make adobo. Pork belly. We've got salmon. Some more sausages. And we've got this bacon. Look at this. <laughs> Look how... 
Bacon. So many eaten smoked bacon. Um, and we've got like a teeny tiny tiny salmon for sandwich. Oh, I thought it was bigger than that. Mature cheese. Uh, what else here? I'm walking. So we've got crackers. Like that crackers. Jacob cheese uh, for sorry Jacob crackers for the cheese. Lots of beans going on here. And we've got Heinz ravioli, beans. Oh, and we've got this digital thermometer for the kids. Um, what's this? Salad cream. Yep. Another Heinz minion. Uh, this one, baby shampoo. Some more pot noodles, just junk foods in general. Garlic. And um, what else? A giant comforts. Jaffa cakes. These are just like mostly food, really. <laughs> we will never get hungry here. Um, baby bath. What's this? Alti crumbles, crisps, eggs, onions, watering can for Nicola. Uh, and what's this? Oh, basmati rice. Why basmati? Daddy, why did you get a basmati rice? Uh, why did you get a basmati rice? Why? Why? I didn't. Yeah, it says basmati. It should be jasmine. Well, they've got it wrong. All oh, right, okay. But we've got two jasmine rice in the um, pantry. Uh, two small ones. That will take us a long time to eat. Yeah, but I don't really like basmati. Radox. Uh, that's giant. One liter. Um, some more buns. Um, uh, what are these? Yeah. Burger, burger meats, yeah, and some pork, pork loins, yeah, yeah, I think that's it, and what's this, some more things there, baby bath and stuff, yeah, and then there's more there, which is like a beer, like, really, <laughs> it's like we're having a party, <laughs> I'm having a party, <laughs> And look at this one, like giant crisp. Like I will, I'm gonna let Will hold this one and see how massive that is. <laughs> We've got like two of those. Like two pounds. <laughs> yeah, they're like two pounds. It's so cheap. Like it's unbelievable. Honestly, if you if you do come here in the UK, you're gonna be really fat. <laughs> Just keep eating like cheap food. Kalpol, some more uh, green apples, pot noodles. And this one, some stuff for the bath. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we've got one of these, but they've got like ruined over time. That was it. Um, so we'll call this a month's worth of grocery. <laughs> I think it's more than that, really. I think we could really do with some more meat. But then we can't really like just keep buying meat and then just uh, stock them in the fridge. It will have to be like at least once a week that you're going to get. Oh, I forgot the Philadelphia cheese. Thing because oh. Nicola likes it anyway, so yeah, it just gives you an idea on how much things you can get here really cheaply and re let me like really good quality. I mean, the quality control of food here in Norway is amazing, anyway. Um, it is good, but we're not in Norway. Oh, in the UK, sorry. Oh my god, I'm still in my I'm still in Norway, but the food quality control in Norway is also good, uh, yes, <laughs> but they're just cheap. Oh, expensive. Yes. I've got it mixed up now. Anyway, so I'm going to end this now and I'll see you guys in the future. Bye.